Right, we're going to start off on Crazy Fruit. £15 jackpot, 20p a go. On Christmas Eve, £20 on each machine. I've just finished installing a new display cable for this machine as the original isn't damaged. Squished. This is for you, John, when you watch this video. Just <clears throat> sub does he want to know what the different brightness of LEDs are? These are the dim LEDs here, 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 and here. The bright ones are obviously this green, this orange, this green, and the whites, and this one red. There's a dim red in there. Dim reds there, dim oranges, dim oranges, one dim green, more dim oranges, and they're the bright whites. So there you go, John, just so you know on that one, I'll show on a different machine as well. That's not for you lot, that's for a friend of mine. I wanted to know what a different player these look like, because it hurts his eyes. Nudge frenzy. One more for Tootie Fruity would be nice. Let's take Nudge frenzy. This one pretty much as it looks. Literally, it's another frenzy, just have to keep nudging until you get to the closest win. <clears throat> if I was a bit quicker without a camera, I can't actually get the jackpot. I'll try and get bongo bananas if I can. So you have the, the machine, when this is lit, just this in VG, you press this, and it'll tell you what number it was going to give you. That's the bright, and that's the dim. <laughs> or is it the idea of this game is to try and fill the ladder? If you've not played Grace Through, fill the ladder, fill the matrix shot, or get to Tutti Fruity, which is guaranteed jackpot.
But the machine will always try and kill you off. Obviously, we want this to flash and go mad for it. <laughs> so, if you can get as more many shots as possible, you get to play up here. So, you get four shots up there. There you go, and that was the full matrix. I've not had a repeat on this yet, so. It'd be nice if it repeated once, but it hasn't yet. Not that I remember anyway. Usually when you get a jackpot, you don't usually get another jackpot afterwards. They'll try and kill you off. But in rare cases, it'll keep you going. It depends if it's in happy mode or not. So I'll just take shots to show you. Fiver. Bellman run, you just press that. You just keep pressing it. And just, you know, just keep giving you numbers. Not sure if that LED is not working or not. It should have lit up those those few times, but I'll have to check later. And when you get the when you're on the features, don't go anything lower. I got band of gold. Anything below band of gold, no, it's rubbish. Yes, yeah, so this should be lighting up now, but it's not, so I'll have to get later. This is just a skill stop. I'm gonna just put the camera down while I do this one. Going for the key. Fills the matrix a bit more. So I'm gonna do the shots again because it's six. See if we can get any good. Jackpot, there you go, another jackpot. And that was from the Matrix shots. It's gone flat now, as you can see. It's not getting me get on the top book. Oh, it's going to go one more time while it's sold all three. So it's gone again. It's a three pound. So I need melon and the bar there, strawberry bar and bell there. It's got bars, so we need melon. I'm gonna shuffle the runner. So now I need 
That one and bar. I already have bar, but shuffling it, there you go, kill tomorrow. Just going to have to put more money in this. Hang on a minute, so I can let it dump out. Show you it all going out. Improve I'm not lying. There you go. So that was crazy fruit. Move on to the next one, which is Club Crazy Fruit. And these are all, by the way, on 78%. Except the club, I've put the club about 84. Because it was a bit too, too lenient before. On, so I've put it up a little bit, just so it's a little bit more fairer. But the rest are all on the standard 78%. And this one is 25p ago. So this one will go a little bit quicker than Crazy Fruit. You can't save your nudges on this one, and you can't cancel them either. But you can use Bellman Run to drop all your nut reels down. It's quite a handy little feature. I haven't won anything big on this machine yet, not on camera anyway, the biggest I won off camera was 75. So I was nearly to the jackpot. And that was about three months ago. I think I may have caught it on camera, again can't remember. But this does not have a mad frit mode, this never flashes, there's no invincible that I'm aware of that I haven't seen yet. So if anybody knows how to get that mode, put it down in the comments because I'd like to know if there is one. Because I've played this machine for a long time and never got one. Someone says there, there is, but I've asked Bell for it and they said that they don't remember. If you can't get it in test, you can get it in test in that one. There's no way of getting it in test in this one. And Bell for it won't tell me. People have told me there's a, a, a little trick to this one, but again, I've tried it, it doesn't seem to work on mine unless it's a different software. But again, no one's told me which software is hackable. Repeat board. Obviously three stars at the lower board, four stars straight to the top board. You can trigger the top board if you get three bells. So if you can get three bells, you trigger the top board. Or if you fill the Matt Ludge Nadder or the Shop Matrix, you can get the top board. So I need another bell. And it's guaranteed jackpot because obviously it hasn't gone there, so it is jackpot. But it's programmed to do that. Well, that's very nice. I'm going to gamble one. 
So now I've got £10 on the bottom there. But it has to be up here. Bells will trigger the top board. Now it's to 12. I'm pushing my luck now. I'm pushing the luck on this. There you go, I pushed it too far. Should have took me to all quid. And this has a new display in, by the way. If anyone hasn't noticed, it's got a new dot matrix. No more alphumeric, because the alphumeric burns out. If I had a nudge there, that would have been nice, would have got four stars. And there's no point going for your fruit starts because you're not going to go and take it aboard. You might as well just get your stars. Really with this one, if you can get this start half fill, it's pretty good, or this half fill, because it will try and give you the top board.
move on to Pink Panther. Just turn those two off so we can not listen to the fans on them. Which are quite a loud and not just fans. Turn the volume up and pin panther. That's better. I turned it down so it didn't annoy my neighbours last night. <laughs> they don't like these noises, they make too much noise. Everyone knows them, everyone understands Pimp Bam, though it's just high and low. Obviously what you want to hear is an extra life. That means you're safe then in this machine. So I mean it will kill you. Last on this. I think pink is pretty much a shot game. So let's try again because it's super mode. I try to leave it a little bit. Doesn't seem to make much difference, but I sometimes do. Usually you get between 8 and 10 on this in super mode. 6, not too bad. Start in the right direction. Now 
And that's rare too, to have that do that. <laughs> Excuse me. Lucky show behind me switching on. It's on a timer. Got one of those little remote things in your pocket. Great little things when you can't when you get your socket to find your machine. That one's all right if you can get yes, because it's quite good. Put an extra file within, just because we can. No, nope, gonna just stay as it is, broken even 20. Again, turn the volume back up on this one. It's still not loud enough for... Oh. I'll just put a new board in this one. Because they all one necked it up. I had a problem with the back board since I bought it, so I changed it finally. Thank you. 
and this does have Invincible, this will flash and you hear a dolphin sound. Go to auction because I've got quite a few high numbers in there. Oh, he did offer us a good one at the start. What do you think? Pound? I think a pound. Yep. Oh, jail. Game over in this one. 